Welcome to Brent Replays with Himself, a Let's Play series where I go back and play the games I love because I love them. On this episode, Poison Ivy gets her just desserts, and then I start my hunt for Riddler. It gets a bit menial, but I have friends and the conversations are actually kind of funny, so enjoy. You know, where people could follow you and other such things. What are you going to play next? Tell me. Tell me. Man of Medan. Ooh, the curator's cut. I will say I loved playing Man of Medan. I loved playing Man of Medan with you. That's what she thinks. It's the best way to get there. Uh, turn around that way. Okay. I can do that. Oh, da 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 dear. Oh, there it is. I was like, where is it? It's a free add on now. I still haven't gotten it. I should do that after I finish this. I've, uh, yeah, I knew about the free add-on. You told me about it. Thank you, by the way. Um, does it add stuff? Like, is it a different game? Because, again, I thoroughly enjoyed our Let's Play of it. You? What's weird about what you just said is you'd think they'd know that I would just wait till they blew their spores out, destroy them, and then rip out their fucking guts. That one's moving. I've never seen that one. Boop. You get to do different viewpoints pretty cool, actually. I liked Man of Medan. Man of Medan was cool. It was a good game. I enjoyed us playing together just for the, uh... Fuck. Um... Just for the parts where <laughs> you and I we're playing, and it was like, Oh no! I'm being chased by a monster! And I'm like, Stop running! And you're like, Never! <laughs> I was just like, Stop running! Because you thought you were being chased. It was good. It was fun. Fun, fun. I like that it's very short, too. I... Oh, what the fuck? What the fuck? Shit! I gotta pee again! Cause I'm drunk! But then, I didn't know there were fucking snipers! Damn it!
Okay. <clears throat> Once you're done, Man of Medan, you want to know what the next game you should play is. That's a tough one. So. Ooh. Heavy Rain. I've heard really good things about Heavy Rain. So part of me wants to say, like, Heavy Rain. I actually don't... I don't actually know anything about a Plague Tale. The name sounds familiar in that I've heard people be like, Oh, Plague Tale. But I don't know how good it is. I, 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 I actually don't know enough about it. But, right. Sorry. Okay. So, what you're saying is, Heavy Rain would make sense because of your Let's Play of Detroit. Which, I agree... It's a similar game. The vibe I get from you, Blitzgirl, and please correct me if I'm wrong, is you very much enjoy a good story game. And so, personally, I could see Heavy Rain being that for you? Um, I bet that'll finish it off. So, I mean, yeah? Heavy Rain would make sense, but like, is there another game that makes... Oh, shit. Is there another game that you want to play? Like, the only reason I say that is because I'm, I really love the Batman games, and I love this Batman game. But, do I want to jump from Asylum straight into City? Yes. But, for variety's reasons, I'll probably jump into Control next. Just because I bought it, it's there, and it's different, and I've never played it. So there's variety. That would be my only stipulation with that. But, at the same time, it's your life, it's your game. Why'd you scream? I thought you loved me. Um... I guess it boils down to that, right? I do want to buy Control. I was able to buy Control for $30 Canadian during Boxing Day. That being said, it was Boxing Day. It was a bitch to get into GameStop. I waited in line. I waited in line to get into GameStop. I've never waited in line, ever. Boxing Days or not. But anyway, no, there's definitely no bad guys in here. Yes, please. Um, however, that's me. I'm back! Had to drive my grandma home. Good job being a good human being. I personally cannot say I would drive my grandma home. She's dead. Thanks for bringing that up. Um, no, good job. I'm glad. Welcome back! I will be streaming Heavy Rain and a Plague Tale. Just a question of which was first. Uh. I don't know! Again, like, what is a Plague Tale about? I only claim to know video games. I do not know video. Don't burst! Thank you. Spores! What's a Plague Tale? I'll ask online too. You absolutely should. Don't, don't take my requests. Ugh. Teeth! 
the number of women who have asked me those questions are literally just poison ivy, actually. I've never been asked if I could handle them or anything else. Um, and in this specific scenario, no. No, I, 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 I honestly don't think I could. You are a psychopathic, plant-controlling monster, and... Whoa! Escalation? What is that about, lady? You're gonna kill me? Zero real-life women. Hey! Hey! What the hell? Oh. Stairs. Yes. Oh, good. Hey! Let's not be sexist. You want equality. You don't want the... Wait, you're guards! No, you're good guys! Come at me, bro! I'm sorry! You've mind controlled your own people! What's wrong with you? Ivy, why? I do like poison ivy as well. Says the two women watching your stream. Hey! Do not team up against me! No! I am a... I've been... I've had to do a couple of drinks since you left, uh, Haley. But, I am a middle-aged white man. I get whatever I want. I can't even finish that. It's how ridiculous that is. Jesus Christ. Look at how abs... Those are just... That's how the costume looks. There's no abs. A healthy bat. There's a bulge. Holy shit. <gasps> how dare you strike me. I gotta say, the look is... Uh... Put on pants would be my only suggestion. But other than that, she frightens me. Jesus, this this escalated quickly. Hey, could you not do that? No, I need to do it. Cool. Here's my giant fucking Venus flytrap. Why? Huh? Huh? You fool! No! Fucking crap. Fuck it. Stop it! Okay. Oh shit, I wasn't paying attention! I'm gonna die. Not because I think I'm gonna die. Ooh, I just needed a good drink. It does look like the Witch of Isleth. But it's not, it's worse. Oh, fuck off. Open your thing again. Ah. Don't whine. Ah! Just crazy lady plant mutations. Put on pants. That's what I have to say to you, poison ivy. Put on pants. Damn it. 
Ugh. Have any of you ever seen me, like, drunk? Because you're seeing me drunk. I have a burp. Nope. Okay. Oh, God. I guess I could just put less rum in my drinks. That was just me drinking Coke, but... I think I'm... I have, like, one more drink in me. And then I gotta switch to something else. Orange juice. <gasps> Orange juice! Okay. Smack it! Give me some more! Smack it! Oh, middle. Okay. Or not. Ah, I got it. Oh, fuck you. I had that. Haha. Uh -huh. Ooh. Okay. Ha! Huh? It's all about that timing, baby. Have you ever been hit in the face with a batarang? Hi, my name is Doug. Have you been hit in the face with Batman's batarang? Do you think that was an unfair attack on your person? Then call me, Doug. I'll get the bat settlement you deserve. Shit, I fucked up, I fucked up. Oh my god, I didn't fuck up. He. They made the spores smaller. Good on you. Do it again. How many hits do you take? I don't remember you taking this long. I want to read your guys' messages. But I'm focused. Uh, I could hear, shit, hear what to, you could hear what to, I got it, <gasps> maybe I should play Dark Souls next. I am playing on the hardest difficulty. So, that's what I'm at. Won't I? Shit. I'm playing on the hardest difficulty. Mm. 
Remember that time you were like, I'm better than you. And then you realized you weren't? Ha ha! Not because you're a woman, but because you're a villain. And I have justice on my side. Shit! Oh. That was weird. Oh boy. Oh boy. In the middle. Hang on. Are you attempting to deflower? <laughs> Fuck. For everyone watching on YouTube after I edit this, the phrase was, are you deflowering poison ivy? And yes, that is the dream. Hey, man. You're the only one left. Congratulations. Oh, boy. Enjoy that. Yeah. She doesn't really like men. What the? Still alive. Get out of here! I say, Poison, why don't you do that thing you do that lets me attack you? Ah! Well, don't do the usual thing. I may be but just a man dressed as a bat. But I do declare you should probably change your theories up. Change up your attack. That's how you don't get hit with a batarang. In the fast. Men? Yep. Shit! Fuck! Ah! Poison Ivy, you absolute maniac. You did it! You blew it up! Break your leg. Tack you, tack you, tack you. Get out of there. Well then, don't do the normal stuff. I, I'm trying to help her here, guys. Really? Ow! Touche, poison ivy. Shit. Ooh. Yeah, cause you're a crazy bitch. Listen, I don't like saying that. I am. Pro woman. However, you gotta admit, Ugh, middle. Middle. Okay. Yep. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Okay. <laughs> Everyone should be plants that eat me and damn dirty apes. You're absolutely right. The two of you together. Why is my target audience like late 20s women? Is that my target audience? I'm okay with it. Oh shit. Things are escalating. Batman! Get out of here. <gasps> this is the end of the game. Oh my god, I'm at the end of the game. I can beat this tonight. What time is it? Oh, I'm beating this tonight. I'm going to finish the puzzles. Yes! Fuck! 
pa da pa da me. Yes. Okay. I'm gonna go pee, and then I'm gonna beat the game. Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna beat this game tonight. I'm gonna beat this game tonight. Yes. I'm back. <sighs> oh. That's it. I'm done. <gasps> oh. I got this. Oh my god. Why do I have so many puzzles? Okay. So. This is the last place I need to go. So I'm gonna do here, 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 okay. Oh my God. Okay. Oh boy. <sighs> ah, no, no. <laughs> Ah, I shouldn't forget about the psychopaths. I'm at an... <laughs> it's like that fight all over again. Oh. Yeah, we both will have beaten the game tonight. What? Okay. So for the next little bit, I'm just going to rambly talk. Give me topics to rant about, and I will rant the hell out of them. Okay, okay. So everyone, give me things to rant about. What do you got? What? What do you got? What do you got for me? Ooh, I don't know. Nazis. Awful. Done. That's it. I... Okay. Remember that time? What the? Oh, it's inside. God, I'm drunk. I'm drunk, y'all. Give me a topic to talk about. I'll rant on about it. Anything. One word answers. Just go, uh, talk about this. And I'll just rant about it. Star Wars. I fucking... Fucking lunatics! Get out of here! Okay, I should do this then. Where is he? Over there? I don't give a fuck. Star Wars? I love Star Wars. Lip Balm. <sighs> I have a love-hate relationship with Lip Balm. In that, I love to hate it. I've yet to find a flavor of Lip Balm I like. I mean, Chapstick is... Especially in Calgary, a very dry city. Notoriously dry. Where are you? Lunatic? Oh, shit! Whoa! Whoa! You got me. You got me on that one. Um. Anyway, uh, no, I mean, Chapstick's a love-hate relationship. It's dry here in Calgary. But at the same time, like, there's no good flavors. My daughter has a bunch. That's it. That's all I have on that. I have a kid. <laughs> In case you didn't know. No! Peppermint lip balm is not high impact fonts. Lip balm uh, does nothing for me. It just makes my lips worse. <laughs> I mean, I don't like cinnamon, so I don't know how that'll help. 
And Blitzko, you live in Seattle. Do you need lip balm? Isn't it humid there? Like, again, this isn't me being like, you're an idiot. This is me going, I don't, I've never been to Seattle. But I imagine it's, like, isn't it humid? Is it not humid? You have stupid lips. Okay. <laughs> that is a weird response. I don't know what to do with that. I find... They don't heal properly. Are your lips just, like, really, like, awful? I don't understand. Everyone's different, but... If your lips don't heal, but do you need... But, like, that doesn't answer the question of, like, do you need lip balm? I would presume you don't. Do you? Because you're... Yeah. I don't... Again, I, I could absolutely be wrong. But I just feel like you wouldn't need them. Okay. I know where to go, Nap. Okay. Intensive treatment... Yeah, I don't want to do intensive treatment. That sucks. Okay, so am I done here? What teeth am I missing? Oh, I see them. Hang on. Ten teeth. Sweet. Depends on the person. <laughs> I don't use it because it doesn't help me. It dries out faster if I use it. That tells me that it's humid where you are and you shouldn't use it. Again, I don't live in a humid place. Although, and this is just a personal opinion, I feel like Calgary is getting humid. There were points in the summer where I felt like Calgary was humid. And as far as climate change is, is concerned, that's bad. A typically dry place in the summer became humid. But that's just me. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe other people are like, it, it didn't get humid. I don't know what he's talking about. He's dumb as hell. But I thought Calgary got humid in the summer. I disagree entirely. Well, you two are going to have a gay old time debating the validity of humidity. That is a song or a band. Hello! We are validity of humidity! Do you disagree that Calgary got humid in the summer? Because, again, like, that's fine. I just, I personally think it did. Oh. You do disagree with me. Well, fuck you! I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm okay as long as you disagree with someone else. The second you disagree with me, oh, you motherfucker. I got you now. Where am I going? Okay. I'm just solving secrets, so I'm just chatting with you, my buds. And leap through the door. Why do you open slowly? Open like a human. Please. Okay. Did I... Er, I actually don't know if I solved this one. I can't imagine I didn't. Oh, shit. Um, I didn't mean to do this. Crap. Crap. What? No. Get back up there. Oh. Oh. Oh, I see what I did wrong. I'm an idiot. 
Did I solve this one? Does anyone remember the riddle I solved? Do 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 do. Cause it's right here. It's already solved, people. Where were you on that one? People. Wait, what's going on here? Shit. Damn it! Ugh, I don't want to do this. Where do I? Hang on. Maybe I do. Do I? Because this will take me to the sewers, right? Two dents in the wall? You don't know the riddle! May not be a riddle! Yep. Okay, here we go. Okay, where am I going? Down to this long hallway and at the end. Nailed it. Okay. And leap. Why is the water so green? That's bad. Didn't I stop it? Maybe I didn't. Who knows? Um. The riddle map just shows me question marks. It doesn't show me what they are. So. That's why I'm like, yeah. It may not be. Oh, I remember this now. Anyway, I personally believe that uh, it was humid in Calgary this summer. Climate change is real, folks. Even though, what's your name? ABOP doesn't believe in climate change. I, you know what? I'm going to take the other side of that argument. I believe it does exist. ABOP doesn't believe in climate change. Hashtag. Be woke, ABOP. It's right here, isn't it? Jesus fucking Christ. Yeah, it was. It was up there. But there's an entranceway to the sewers, so I figured... Two birds, one stone. Why not? I'm beating this tonight, by the way. Beating it tonight. I have five viewers! Five viewers! I did this for fun, so I don't really care. But, for the other four people, because I imagine I'm one of them. Oh, I'm back down to four. That's a fucking sad thing. I was going to say hi to the fifth. Sadness. It is what you said, Abob. You don't believe in climate change. It's fine. We're all allowed to believe in our beliefs. You're wrong. But, I'd like to point out, you're wrong. Am I done in the sewers? <gasps> yes! The caves are done! Let's get the hell out of here, boys! Hello! Uh, can we get out of here? Yeah, we can. A bop does not believe in. A bop does not believe in climate change. She believes in nothing but. I bet you would have voted for Trump too, wouldn't you? I would never accuse anyone of ever voting for Trump. That's like saying I wish someone got Lou Gehrig's disease. Just no. It's an awful thing. I wouldn't wish it upon my worst enemies. Similar situation. <laughs> you know it's b You know you're a shitty president when you're compared to getting Lou Gehrig's disease. We're just part of a grand liberal. This is the future. Did I accidentally start like a gigantic political comment? Because... Yes, please. No, not the vent, you dummy. Bruce? Bruce. 
I love you. You know I love you, Bruce. But you gotta remove your head from your ass. Let's slowly climb up this elevator shaft. I remember being here. Rachel! I'm solving puzzles! Oh my god! You all don't know what I'm dealing with on a daily basis. Razor! I don't have any data happening anymore. Razor. What? I did this. What am I doing then? It's right here! What am I doing wrong? It's got to be further up. <laughs> remove, your, remove your bat head from your bad ass. Ooh, bad ass. Bad ass? My God. Am I secretly sponsored by RKG? I wish. God, I wish. If RKG branched out and they were like, Let's support local streamers. I'd be like, me. Do me now. There's a dead guy up there. Is anyone else concerned about that? Gavin on Instagram did say he would hire me for the puns. Just saying. Rachel! I still haven't played Sekiro... And I'm really worried about it. I don't want them to spoil Sekiro for me. But at the same time... I honestly can't say I give a shit. <gasps> I heard you, Teeth! Get out of your Teeth. Hey! That was, that's sad. What's here? An interview tape. How did I miss this? Who? Sekiro's easier than Dark Souls? Is that what I play? No, I'm going to play Control next. I'm in the mood for like a mind fuck game. Beyond Death Stranding. Because that game, Jesus Christ. The rain makes things age. But there's like oil monsters. And rainbows are evil. Which I'm like... Is that the message we want to send out? Rainbows are bad? Because that seems anti-pride. But hey. Oh, they're inverted rainbows. Oh. So they're just Roy G. Iv. Roy G. Iv. There's no blue. Roy G. Iv. I, I honestly have no idea what's going on with that. Because, yeah, like, the rain ages things, except metal, because the vehicle's driving it. Um, yeah, that, it's a messed up game, man. It's good. Don't get me wrong. It's messed up, though. Messed up. It doesn't matter. Wait a second. It doesn't matter. Nope. doesn't matter. Messed up in a good way. Sure. I'm really confused by it. I dig it, though. Like I said, the atmosphere is good. More topics. Come on, people. Give me more... Wait, what? Should I not have gone... Oh, is it all on the lower level? Mother... Fucker. Open up again. I fucked up. New Year's resolutions. Ooh! Um... I have many aspects of my life that I need to be aware of. So... For my New Year's resolutions, 
again, I have aspects of my life that I need to focus on. So, streaming-wise, my resolution is to stream as much as I can. I gotta pee again. I broke the seal. This is awful. The seal's not real, but it is. Biologically. It was explained. Super quick, fantastic. Uh, news resolutions. <laughs> you have created two separate conversations, Blitz Girl. Um, okay, so. News resolutions. As a parent, my resolution is to provide a more structured breakfast. It sounds ridiculous, but when I was a kid, my mom had a schedule for breakfast. It's the, it's the Enigma Show. And it was, Mondays was cream, cream of wheat. Cream of wheat. And uh, oatmeal. Not and, or. It alternated week by week. So. Then Tuesdays were scrambled eggs. I love scrambled eggs. My mom's scrambled eggs are really good. My mom's scrambled eggs were um, cracked two egg, or I mean, however many eggs you need to make scrambled eggs, um, into a bowl. Then you would put shredded cheese and salt and pepper, mix it up, put it in the frying pan, scramble it. Delicious. Loved my mom's scrambled eggs. Perfect. It is. It is so important. Um, so the scrambled eggs. Wednesday was cereal. Uh, Wednesdays were specifically like a healthy cereal. So it was like shredded wheat, but not like the shredded wheat little squares. It was like the... Do you remember the bricks? Of <laughs> like shredded wheat? And you poured milk in and then you cracked it up. That. Thursday was fried eggs. Um, the eggs always came with bacon, FYI. I, met, I, I skipped that, but it was always eggs and bacon. Thursdays were fried eggs. And then... Um, fried eggs. Friday was... Fun cereal. Yeah. Friday would have been, like, fun cereal, so tricks... Um, Fruit Loops, whatever fun, less healthy cereal there was. Then Saturday and Sunday was like pancakes, waffles, whatever my dad at the time wanted to cook. So, parenting-wise, my resolution is to do better breakfast. Right now, her breakfasts are like cereal or bagels. Whatever she wants, but I kind of enjoy... The mix and the variety. So, that's going to be that. That's that. Um, unfortunately, and I'm drunk enough now to be completely honest with people. Those bricks, don't, don't badmouth the bricks. The bricks are delicious. I really... Liked the bricks, actually. Um, my favorite cereal to date, though, is Harvest Crunch. Just that healthy Harvest Crunch cereal. I, I honestly could not tell you why. It just is. I find it really delicious. Um, but yeah, 
What riddle is that? There's a riddle here, and I'm missing it. And I don't... Oh, it's an interview tape. I'm an idiot. You, you, you make the flavor! Sprinkles of brown sugar? Milk? Brown sugar. Milk? White sugar. You add flavor. Get your head out of your ass. Um... Oh, I love Harvest Crunch. It's so healthy for you, and it's just so naturally good. God, I love Harvest Crunch. Um, I love Harvest Crunch. So, uh, parenting-wise, breakfasts. She eats bagels or cereal. I, I still stick to, like, weekdays. It's, like, Honey Nut Cheerios, stuff like that. Weekends, Nutter Butter Cereal, Cinnamon Toast Crunch, Tricks. Whatever sugar cereal she wants. Um, on a personal level, um, it is easy for me to blame a very bad ex-girlfriend on my mouth hygiene. Um, we didn't have a lot of money. She... As far as I'm concerned, she was fucking siphoning me for money. This was a long time ago, too. Like, when I was 18. But, um, the moral there is, um, I couldn't even afford a good toothbrush, so my teeth are awful. So, on a realistic way... Is this? Okay. <clears throat> a deranged gag leader, Maxi Zeus, came to believe himself an avatar of the Olympian god Zeus. Creating a cult of gang members to do his bidding, Zeus became a power player in the Gotham City underworld. His criminal activities are perpetuated by his army of followers and, he believes, Unfor overseen by the Greek gods themselves. So, if you're just tuning in now, these are like all of the Batman, like, not all of them, but like Batman villains. I enjoy it. Anyway, uh, so my every year I make it my resolution to brush my teeth every day take better oral hygiene care of myself um cause I don't I, I just don't and every year I make it a goal cause I need to it's really important <laughs> consider this the Brent Sutherland nearly competent new year message take care of your teeth guys just take care of your teeth I, okay, I'm going to get real with everyone for a minute. Ready? I have not been to a dentist in years, years, and I honestly regret it, because I'm the same. I hate absolutely hate dentists I had a really bad experience once and it it haunts me but really important it's really important to take care of your teeth. So, every year on a personal level, I do that. So, three levels, nearly competent. I aim to just stream as much as I can. I enjoy streaming, but it's when I'm in my, like, anxiety, depressed areas. That's when I go... 
I, I just stop and I just can't be bothered. So, to you guys, my resolution is, I'm going to... I'm going to do my best. Is it up? It is. It's fucking up. I f is it? Wait. It is. Yeah, I gotta go that way. God damn it! Fucked it up. So, just so everyone's aware. Yeah. Uh, nearly competent wise. Stream. Um... I'm in a really good place right now. I, uh... So, it's not a concern. Depression in that. I'm, uh... I mean... I'm in a good place. That's all I'm gonna say about it. I... I have people that care about me. I'm... I'm really happy. I'm in a good place. So... Yeah. And then personal, or, uh, personal teeth, parenting. I want to try to do better breakfasts. And that's me. What are your guys' New Year's resolutions, actually? Cheers. I hate that I haven't gone, but dental visits always frustrate me. I want to get back into writing and drawing this year. Why is Galarian Mr. Like so hard to catch? Just want we said Mr. Mime. Yeah, you misspelled Mr. Mime and it's Mr. Like. No idea what you were talking about. Galarian Mr. Mime. What is up with Galarian Mr. Mime? He has a fucking tie. He's a professional. He's a businessman. It's not my business, man. I'm just a businessman. Jay Z said that. So, yeah. I had no problems catching Mr. Mime. Also, are you done, Sword, yet? Because I need some shield Pokemon. Get on it. You switched to your phone? Oh, okay. I'm glad I'm not worth your, like, laptop. Now I'm just your fucking phone. Rude. Rude. Whatever. Oh, no, that's not the way I need to go. Oh, this one has a bomb on it. I was like, wait, do these have bombs on them? They do. Fucking Joker. Hey, remember that time I totally nailed two areas? Let's go backwards through this! Yay! Uh, Brent, if you're watching, fast the fuck forward through this. Done. Thank you all so much for watching. To join my guests and I live, check out our Twitch channel, Nearly Competent. You can reach us at the social media links in these credits. And if you want to support us even more, check out our Patreon. Thank you to the fiends currently supporting us. We will see you all next time. Have a good evening.